in Japan to be here tonight to wrestle. He came here to settle the score with Toa. Well, you know what? Toa stubbed his toe. And he can't wrestle because he's hurt. We all know he's scared! Huh? He's scared of big teeth! That's why he ain't here today! That's right, he is scared! You know who's not scared? This man right here. Nope, not one else! And that's why, that's why I've come out here to invite whomever in the back has the guts to take on Tito. I wonder who's going to pick up Whoever the Whoever it is. I don't think a lot of people really have the guts to want to fight Tito. Oh my goodness! Oh my god! Oh my god! The war machine! Rhino! 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 Gore! 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 ECW World Champion, the last ECW World Champion, former NWA World Champion, Rhino is at the Mecca. In the business, we do what's called laying out sometimes. I don't need to say a word, let the people speak for us. once more. Classic example of unstoppable force meets immovable object.
come suddenly and you never forget how it feels. Wait, freezing. Freezing. Well, it's a gore. I'm talking about a gore. Not LA gore, but Rhino's finisher. I, I, I'm, we're just going to go back to the ring. Fighting in the crowd where I really feel the fans are more unsafe than either of the competitors. Now, Rhino loves it out here. From his days of ECW, Rhino loves to be on the floor because he can punish you. Now we're into the crowd, it seems like. From a vantage point, it's hard to tell. Yes, they are in the crowd. This is a dangerous situation. Not so much for the wrestlers. Hell, for the fans. Yeah, the wrestlers like it this way. I saw a trash can flying. That's about all I can see. Yes. Just let the pictures speak for themselves right now. We made it back. I thought we got back in the ring. We didn't. Now we're fighting to the outside of the ring, and I can see them better now. And and Tito is just hammering Rhino, but Rhino cuts him off. interactive experience when you buy a ticket to the Mecca. Wait, Rhino's got... Beer me. Yeah! I think Tito just ordered a double. It's like a $20 punch in this building. Rhino using the ring as a weapon. And Tito recovers quickly. I'm the man. I'm the man. Well, they're getting closer to the ring. And they made it. And we are we are officially. Wait, wait, I'm waiting, I'm waiting. We are officially back in the ring. After tearing up the Hefe Betts event center here at the Silver Nugget Casino, they've decided to end it where it started. And we have Silver, Man Silver Nugget management right now tapping us on the shoulder. And you can see them look of horror and shock on their face. Yeah, they don't like it when that stuff spills into the fans, into the crowd. The rider doesn't like being choked up. In the middle rope. Now we are in North Las Vegas. The crowd might be more dangerous than wrestlers. Yeah, especially in this part. Yep. Like I said, MK once again interjecting himself in a match. Well, given the part of town we're in, maybe, maybe someone in our audience would take him out for good. We can only hope so. Wait, Rhino's starting to feel it. See it look, I've seen it. I know that familiar shape. That's Rhino feeling the pain being fueled by it. Rolling forearm there, and Rhino is felled. And Tito boot scrapes from hell. a two-time former world champion right where he wants him. Now 
Now Tino, Tito, Tito working on that neck of Rhino. Just trying to wear Rhino down, but the faithful here will not let Rhino go quietly into the night. And that's a sign of desperation. When you feel your grip slipping, when you feel your opponent making a comeback, rallying, you go straight to the hair. Cover. Oh, I thought he had him there. And, and Tito really trying to deflate these Rhino chants because he realizes Rhino's going to feed off of those. And you, you make a astute point there. Every time the crowd starts chanting Rhino, 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 you see Tito take the shortcut trying to short circuit it because he knows if Rhino starts to feel the emotion, feel the energy, he's going to run off fuel of the faithful. Yeah, positive energy is contagious. And Tito realizes he's got to put a halt to that. And Rhino, he's had some neck issues in the past. And Tito knows that, followed the career, I'm sure, of Rhino. The crowd trying to will Rhino along. They feel his desperation, and they're trying to give him that little boost, and Rhino seems to be feeling it. Rhino, looking for that second win. Again, Tito trying to take the shortcut, no. Rhino stops. Oh, double noggin knocker! Heads collide, the referee get in there to make sure neither has suffered too much damage, but they're both able to continue. Thing is now, even though they're able to continue, will either man be able to get back to a vertical base? And you see referee Scarlet asserting her count. They're at three, she's at three. Counts up to six. Both men have to get to the flat of their feet, standing up at a vertical base. That breaks the count. And Tito was going to try to get a shot in, but Rhino knew it was coming. He heard the footsteps, able to counter immediately and fire back with his own strike. Oh, left-handed clothesline. Rhino's on a roll. Back shot, got elbow. Mini gore. Mini gore. That is usually the precursor to the big boy. The gore Rhino is setting up. MK! MK grabs a hold of a tree trunk. And look at Tito! But schoolboy! Bullet tanks! Down oh, now! The Army is 2-0 tonight in battle. I'm just, I'm not going to say anything because I just want to... Can I go punch MK in the face right now? Can yeah, I go do it? Oh, better! Gore! 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 This blood thirsty crowd is asking for one more. And Rhino looks obliged. He's walking to the corner. And he's squatting down. Here we go. 